Hello, I'm Martin Parr. I'm a photographer, but I'm also sometimes a curator and editor. And uh, I have in front of me my latest book. This is Life's a Beach. I've always been fascinated by the beach. I've been photographing them for a lifetime, if you like. And my first career or my first project that sort of, if you like, gave me some international attention was about the beach called The Last Resort. And since then, I just can't stop. I'm addicted to beaches. I love the beach. You, in America, you have the street. In Britain, we have the beach. So have a look at how this works. So you open up the, the case, and now you see it's like a family album. And what we've done here is we've made a 1,000 copies. So it's very limited, quite expensive. But you can see you get a lot of uh, buck for your money because it's a beautiful production. Each one is signed. I had to sign um, a thousand of these and drop them in, so there's that. Here's the introduction, my brief explanation about, about the beach and my love for it. And what you see on the beach is like a constantly changing theater. And whatever country you go to, you see the different things happening. Uh, you see less clothes, more clothes, things being sold. You see ears being cleaned. You see all kinds of stuff. So the, the world operates on this beach in many different ways in different countries. And what you see is that these are printed photos, but they're then dropped in. And in between the photographs is this tissue paper. And of course, the actual paper itself is this beautiful, slightly rippled linen type of paper. We chose these. I did this with Xavier Barrel, the designer in, uh, in Paris. So they made a French edition, and this is the American version. Uh, so it's beautifully printed. But on the back, the bonus is, uh, it says, this picture was taken by Martin Pye. They actually got the paper uh, with the signature on. That was pretty funky. I'm impressed with that. That's a nice little touch from Xavier Barrel. Uh, if you're a photographer, the one thing you want to do is to make a book. Because the great thing about books, people don't throw them away. How could you ever put this in the bin? Well, as a magazine, it comes and goes. A book, it has to stay forever. Even if you don't like it, you'd have to take it to a charity shop. You couldn't put it in the bin. My mum will be so happy.